And today I'm at the Children's Creativity Museum in San Francisco, California. Do you know what creativity is? It's when you use your imagination to make anything. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Mission control. I'm ready to explore. Whoa, smooth landing. <laughs> Did you see? I was a rocket ship. <laughs> Hey, look at these cool blocks. They're so colorful. Oh, and they feel soft. <laughs> Do you know what shape this is? This is a rectangle. See, there's two short sides and two long sides. Yeah, do you know what color it is? Green, that's right. And look at all the little circles. Ah, huh, these are really cool. Ooh, one of my favorite colors, yellow. Hey, what if we built a rocket ship out of these blocks? All right, let's do it. Maybe this one and this one. Mm-hmm. And we need some wings. Which block would make a good wing? <gasps> this one. And maybe this one. Hmm. Maybe some yellow on the top. Yellow, it's nice and bright. This way space knows we're coming. <laughs> and then maybe this, whoa, yes, it's time to launch this rocket ship into space. Count down with me from 10, ready? 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, blast off. <gasps> We've landed in space. There's no gravity. This is why I'm walking like this. I'm floating because I'm astronaut Mika. Whoa. One small step for inspiration. One giant leap for creativity. <laughs> Whoa. Look at all these moon rocks. You have to hop over them. Will you hop with me? Okay. Nice hopping. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. There's more to create. Let's go. Creativity installed. Whoa, it says launch it. You must be able to launch things here. Huh. <gasps> this is a vertical wind tunnel. Yeah, this Wind down here forces things to go up through the tunnel. This is a great way to test gravity. Do you know what gravity is? It's the force that pulls everything on Earth to the ground. It's also what keeps the planets orbiting the sun. Without gravity, they would just be floating around in space like, like this. Whoa. Hey, looks like there's some items here that we could test to see which ones will float up through the tunnel. It's time for sink or fly. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, look. There's some leaves and flowers. They look really light. Do you think that they'll float up through the tunnel? Only one way to find out. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> Three, two, one. It went all the way up out of the tunnel, and here it comes. Ooh, ooh. I caught it. I'm gonna see if it'll go up again. Okay. Ready? Goodbye, little leaf. Whoa! That's so cool. What else is in here? Oh, <laughs> look at the squishy ball. <laughs> I wonder if this will float up the tunnel. What do you think? It's a little heavier than the leaf. All right, let's try. Three, two, one. Nope. <laughs> 
I think it's too heavy. Oh, look, there's some cotton balls here. See, they're green and soft. They also feel pretty light. Should we try? Maybe we can try both of them at the same time. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. It didn't fly up, but did you see it twirling around? Let's try again. Whoa, nope. <laughs> All right. <gasps> hey, this kind of looks like my bow. Twins. <laughs> this is pretty light too. Do you think it's gonna go up the tunnel? Let's try. <gasps> oh, just went up a little bit. Let's try it again. <gasps> Whoa, that was so cool. What about this? Ooh, this is so pretty. This piece of fabric, yeah. It looks light and floaty. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna let go, ready? Three, two, one. <gasps> Can I catch it? Got it, that was a fun one. I wanna do it again. <gasps> Three, two, one. Blast off! Wow, so it seems like the items that are really light go straight up out of the tunnel. And then the items that are kind of heavy stay towards the bottom or they don't float at all. What about this streamer? You might see this at a birthday party as a decoration, but have you seen a streamer in a vertical wind tunnel? Woo! Ready, set, go! Whoa! Can I catch it? Can I catch it? Got it. <laughs> Gravity is so awesome. Should we pretend to walk like there's no gravity? Okay, let's go. Whoa. 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 There's no gravity. <laughs> huh. I wonder what's going on with this wall. I see some tubes and pipes and this looks like a track and, oh, oh, look, there's a magnet on the side and it sticks to the wall because it's magnetic. Cool. I have a great idea. Let's make a comet run. Do you know what a comet is? It's made of frozen space dust and rock and ice and the closer it is to the sun, the faster it travels because of gravity. So, we could say that this ball is the sun. Ooh, so hot, it's hot. Okay, sun, you stay there. And now, I need to make a comet run. So I'm gonna move some of these pieces so that the ball can travel towards the sun. So let's see, let me move this down like this. What do you think? All right, now, which ball should be the comet? <gasps> what about this one? One of my favorite colors, purple. Okay, do you wanna be the comet? Great. Okay, you got this. You have to travel so fast towards the sun. You ready? All right, three, two, one. Go! Whoa! <laughs> that was amazing! Did you see how fast it traveled? Let's try another one. Maybe this yellow one. One of my other favorite colors. <laughs> okay. Focus on the sun and travel as fast as you can. You got this. Three, two, one, go! Whoa! <laughs> oh, that one fell off. Maybe we should try the purple one again. All right. There's the sun. Travel so, so fast. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, that was amazing. 
This calls for a 10 second dance party. Dance it out with me. Hey, let's go explore some more. Whoa, they even have a space up on the rooftop outside where you can be creative. Look at all of this art. <laughs> Whoa, these are doors. Hello. <laughs> They painted them. Oh, look, a little green squiggly line, and someone painted a heart. Oh, cool. Whoa, this structure kind of reminds me of a rocket ship. Three, two, one, blast off! Hey, they have a smock. That means that I could paint something. Yeah, it's good to wear a smock. Then you can protect your clothes from the paint. <laughs> I'm feeling so inspired. What should I paint? Maybe something in space? I will paint. <sighs> Maybe you can guess. Do you know what planet we live on? <laughs> yeah, Earth. So I'm going to use, you know this color? Blue, yeah, blue like the sky, the ocean. Whoa, I'll make a big circle for our planet Earth. Round and around and around. So there's so much water on Earth and there's a lot of land. So maybe I'll use green too. <gasps> yes, here's green right here. See green like trees, or like a delicious avocado. <laughs> we'll put some green on here too. Oh, okay, there's Earth. And then I think I'm gonna paint some white stars too. Hey, did you know that there's over 100 billion stars in our galaxy? And that our galaxy is called Milky Way. <laughs> we'll just do some stars like this all over. What do you think? I like it a lot. <laughs> wow, well, I'll let that dry for now. <laughs> I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. We got so inspired and we used our creativity and our imagination. Remember when we learned about comets and how they're made of frozen space dust? <laughs> I think that's so neat. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you later. Bye.